Doesn't Elon Musk understand? He could build a teleporter to Mars and no one's gonna give a sh until he builds an actual hoverboard. It's 2015. Where's my hoverboard? Great Scott! Jalopnik's Michael Balaban got to try out the Tesla Model S's new autopilot system and the results are insanely cool. But it's not a complete self-driving car though. It's more like the ultimate cruise control system. Oh my gosh, this is so... I'm not touching it at all and it's driving, whoa, whoa, the lanes are getting a little, oh, no, there it goes, and it stopped. To get started, you have to be going at least 18 miles per hour in an area with clearly marked lanes. The car utilizes a radar, front-facing camera, 12 ultrasonic sensors, and GPS. All of those words taken directly from the future. They tested out the car in New York City traffic, and Balaban was concerned that he might hit a taxi, or a taxi might hit him, or there might be a big taxi him Tesla explosion, because it's New York and these things happen. But it didn't happen! The car even changed lanes and stopped on its own. I'd be terrified. I would be absolutely terrified, but I'd want to trust the car. By the way, this is the same Tesla Model S that's been out for a few years, and it just got a firmware update. Overnight, it just downloaded the ability to drive itself. I'm I mean, impressed. if that happens, our phones overnight sometimes download the ability to not work. It also features ludicrous mode, which accelerates the car from 0 to 60 miles an hour in 2.8 seconds. Ludicrous speed! <gasps> yes, that is a Spaceballs reference. A new Tesla Model S goes for $75,000, but of course you can get that down a few grand after federal tax incentives. Yeah, 70 grand, that's definitely in my price range. Kinda seems like this is the slow transition into our inevitable driverless future, because Uber wants 500,000 self-driving cars on the road by 2020. That's five years that you have to enjoy your car before it's way more convenient to not have one. This is the future. Walking away. Also, apparently, say goodbye to Uber drivers. I have a different job during the week. I just picked up some fine ass chick. You should have seen her. Oh my god, it was amazing. Let's go to the comments. Magnus Kermak says, That sat nav is more beautiful than my kids will ever be. Trevor Shade says, Am I the only one that prefers to be in control? Not that I don't trust its capabilities, but because driving is an adventure. Would you be confident enough to let a car drive you around? Are you afraid of the inevitable robot takeover? Let us know what you think in the comments. Make sure to give us a thumbs up and subscribe to What's Trending. I'm Jay Walker.